what's going on guys i have another video for you and in this one i will show you how to make this 3d logo animation for that we'll need adobe illustrator and after effects and without further ado let's jump straight into the video in adobe illustrator go ahead and select your logo and go to effect 3d and materials and then extrude and bevel here for the 3d type choose extrude choose a depth level that you're happy with you can also enable the bevel function for this one i'm just going to turn it off and then go to materials set the roughness to zero and metallic all the way to one now right click on the logo go ahead hit export selection give a name to your logo and for the format choose gltf and also don't forget to choose a location where to save this go ahead hit export asset and then move to after effects create a new composition give this composition a name for the width and the height i'm going to choose 1080 for the frame rate i'll go with 60 the duration is going to be three seconds and the background color is going to be black now import a gltf file add it to the composition hit ok and then ok again hit s on your keyboard to open the scale menu make it bigger to fit the composition then hit r on your keyboard and make changes to the y rotation i'll just go ahead create a keyframe at the beginning of the composition and then one at the end and change the value to be one X. this is basically going to do a 360 rotation if you want to change the direction of this rotation you can just switch to minus one awesome now if you want to add effects to this you got to make sure you pre-compose it make sure this is checked the just composition duration to the time span of the selected layers after that go to effects and presets choose glow and for the glow i'll make the following changes the glow threshold is going to be 80 percent the glow radius is going to be about 40 and the glow intensity to be two for the glow colors, I'm just going to choose A and B colors, which are basically black and white. And now let's see how this looks. It's adding a very subtle glow effect to it. If we want to add even more, we can duplicate the composition by hitting Command D. In the effects and presets, search for Gaussian Blur. Add the Gaussian Blur, change the value of the blurriness, and then right click on the layer and go to Blend Mode and choose Screen. Last but not least, we gotta change the opacity. Go to your layer, hit T on your keyboard, and then change the opacity to something around 60%, 50%. Awesome, this is how it looks like. It's just adding low effect. So yeah, this is a very basic way to create this 3D logo animation. Hope you found this helpful. If you wanna see more videos like this one, make sure you subscribe, thumbs up so YouTube shows this to more people hit the bell check the description as well and see you on the next video